Hi guys, this is Claire, and I quite literally just got done with my haul video, so if you haven't watched that, go and watch that. But today I'm going to be unboxing Frozen, the two-disc deluxe soundtrack. Unfortunately, it's not the one that folds out, and I do want that, but this is, close, this is as close as I can get right now, so I'm going to take what I can get. I paid $12 for this at Barnes & Noble because they were having a sale, and if you see the tag right here I tried to take it off but it said 19.99 so yeah but yeah let's get into it and I'll tell you the story behind it because it does have a um, no wait let me just tell you right now at Barnes and Noble I ordered the I ordered this from the site well it, they called me two days ago and they said oh it's in and I said okay I'm gonna go down there so I finally got the chance to go down there today and she opened it she's like this isn't the deluxe one and she got really really mad at the fact that they didn't send the deluxe one. It just so happens that they had it in that Barnes & Noble because they weren't supposed to get restocked until the 26th of this month. So, I walked away with this. That's the story behind it. And that Barnes & Noble lady is awesome. So, yeah. Thank you. I appreciate it, even though you're probably never going to watch this. But, yeah. Let's get into this soundtrack. It would be a lot better if I had the other one. I'll eventually get it, though. Get off my keys. Um, here. Oh, what's he saying? I'm, I'm not that bright. Getting this tape off. And I tried to see at FYE if they had Girls' Generation as the boys in, but they didn't. Which I'm assuming it's just completely sold out. So, yeah, hopefully they make another American. See, so that way I can actually buy it. But I like the Korean versions better. It has a lot more stuff included in it, and it looks a lot nicer. As opposed to American CDs, they're just plastic. Nah, I'll take what I can get. So I can't really argue with anybody right now. Um, and while we are on the subject of Disney, well, never mind. I'm not, I'm going to pass on Serena and Tink. I mean, I want them, but I don't want them enough. So, yeah, I'm just going to pass on them. I was originally going to get them, but now I decide not to. Little fragments of this are coming off and it's bugging me. There we go. One more little piece and that should be it. There we go. There's tape everywhere. See? I'm trying to get rid of the tape. Okay, let's get into the city. Well, this is a lot prettier than what I thought it'd be. I thought it would just be one disc somewhere else and then the other on the back of it. This is actually pretty nice. I like this. It's a lot more than what I thought it would be. So, here's the first disc. Here's the second one. That's that's a lot nicer than what I thought it would look like. I thought it would just be simple like blue right here and then white right here. But this is nice. This is really nice. And considering I only paid $12 for it, you know, one win. Let's get into this. I meant to ask them. They had the, the um, uh, songbook. Gosh darn it. Oh well. These are images in here. This is awesome. The reprise! For the first time in forever. That's probably my favorite song at the moment. I need the art book now. Frozen Heart. What's this? Do you want to build a snowman? And the first time in forever. Or first time in... For the first time in forever, sorry. Ugh. I can't talk. Love is an open door. I love this song. Let it go. Awesome. 
in summer. What is that? Reindeer are better than people, and for the first time in forever, reprise. I call it reprise, but I think it's called reprise. But yeah, I I love this image. Fixer Upper. Let it go, Demi Lovato's version. Which it shows it's castle. That's awesome. And then this is why I need to get the art book now, because of these images right here. They're awesome. That's really cool. That's really cool. I like that. I have this thing with art. And then here's credits. And then the disc one has the soundtrack list. And then disc two has the deluxe content in it. And that's an original picture of the Snow Queen. Look at that, that's awesome. I like that. Then that's the end of the book. Overall, I think that I got a good deal for my money. But I still want the other disc to it. I haven't been able to find the art book, but I'll definitely probably get that here soon. But yeah. So, slowly but surely, my frozen collection grows. And, yeah, I, I like this. I I haven't heard any of the demo songs or anything. I'm not going to do a first time hearing for it. But, yeah. This is awesome. I think I like the other one better because it folds out. Sorry, I'm very bitter about that. I should have got it when I seen it. But, you know what, eventually. So, this is the unboxing for the Frozen soundtrack. I do recommend it. Because it's only a few dollars more than the original soundtrack. So, yeah. But if you only like the original songs and you don't care about the extra content, then don't get it. But I think that this is a pretty good deal. Considering I don't buy soundtracks. Like, literally, I don't buy soundtracks. I've never bought soundtracks for movies before, so. Welcome to the Van Dump of Frozen, right? There goes the first one, and... Come on. You can go in there if you want to. Okay, there we go. I do recommend this if you love Frozen. So, yeah, that's this, and I hope you all enjoyed the unboxing. Stay forward to Strawberry Panic unboxing because I'm excited to do that one and then I'll show you guys the fragrances. Okay, bye everyone. I hope you all have a good day, weekend, whenever you watch this. I'm excited. Okay, bye everyone.